The question is whether PBCL2, this is lead to chloride, will be an electrolyte or non-electrolyte. So when we look at electrolytes, they're substances, they dissolve in water or another polar substance, they produce ions. Because we have these ions, the solution conducts electricity. So the question here is whether PBCL2 dissolves in water. Whenever you see lead, you want to be careful. Lead compounds are often insoluble. In this case, if you look up PBCL2 on a solubility table, you'll see that it's slightly soluble. So just a little bit of it will dissolve into ions. So you'll have mostly solid, mostly insoluble, but some will break apart into PB, and that'll be 2 plus, and then Cl, the chloride ion, Cl minus, and we have two of those. So since we have two of this minus here, that's why the lead's 2 plus. We'll put a little AQ after these to show that they're dissolved in the water, but not many. So for that reason, it will be an electrolyte because we have these ions in water, but not many ions are in the water since it's only slightly soluble. So it'll conduct, but not much. We call this a weak electrolyte. So in answer to our question, PBCL2 is a weak electrolyte. This is Dr. V. Thanks for watching.